On Saturday, the Ohio women's basketball team was trying to get to 8-0 for the first time in the Bob Bolton era. I'm WOUB sports reporter Brian Kerp here outside the Convocation Center, and after a slow start from the Ohio offense, they finally heated up in the second half. Bob Bolden and the Bobcats had to discuss ways to get the offense going against Coppin State in the first half. The team only shot 11 of 34 from the field and were 4 of 15 from three-point land. However, the Bobcats took advantage of Coppin State's 18 first-half turnovers. Amani Burke and Kendall Jessing accounted for 19 of Ohio's 30 first-half points. Right here, both of them team up to get two points for the Cats, and then Jessing drains it. The Bobcats went to the locker room with only a 30-26 lead over the Eagles, but Rufus wanted more offense from Ohio in the second half, and that's exactly what he got. The Bobcats opened the second half on a 15-2 scoring run to break open the score. The third quarter was a difference in the game as Ohio outscored Coppin State by 22 points. Gabby Burris was the leading scorer with 19 points. Amani Burke, Kendall Jessing, and Dominique Dosick also reached double figures. The second half offense helped guide the Bobcats to an 87-62 win. Ohio starts the season 8-0 for the first time in Bob Bolden's tenure and for the first time since the 1985 and 1986 season. The Bobcats wrap up non-conference play on the road and that starts next Sunday when they travel to IUPUI. From outside the Convocation Center, I'm WRUB sports reporter Brian Kerr.